Very quickly, let's do Mug, which is a Polish... Uh, Mug, M-U-G? Yeah, it, it, the Polish title, and forgive my Polish pronunciations, everybody. The Polish title is Twarz, T-W-A-R-Z, which means face, Mug, as in face, okay? okay? And it's directed by, and um, forgive me for this, Malgozata, Malgozata Sumowska. And it won the Jury Grand Prize at the Berlin Film Festival. It's inspired by this statue of Christ in Western Poland, which apparently is the tallest in the world, which was completed in 2010. Jacek, who is our sort of uh, center of attention, is working construction on the st statue. He's a kind of likable uh, guy. He's into heavy metal. He has a passionate relationship with his girlfriend. And one day, whilst working on building this massive, massive sculpture, they're trying to put the head on, and he steps back off a platform and he falls and he falls into the statue and he falls on his face. Astonishingly, he survives, but he also then becomes the recipient of a, uh, of a sort of groundbreaking face transplant. And the rest of the drama is about how people react to him, how the church, which has been raising all this money to put the head on the statue, will now deal with someone who has had their has had to have a face transplant because they were building the statue. How much, you know, is his life worth in comparison with the statue? His sister loves him, but will other family members, uh, you know, feel the same way? One of them at least admits to being scared because he doesn't look like he used to. Meanwhile, his girlfriend decides that he's basically no longer the person that she was in love with before and moves on. Now, I am aware that there are some sort of culturally specific elements that I'm missing in the film, but I, I, I really liked it. It starts with this really strange slow motion sequence of people in their underwear doing an underwear stampede into a supermarket to grab bargains, which apparently is a thing which I've never heard of before. And at the beginning, I thought, I can't quite understand what that's about. But then as it went on, you think, oh, it's because the film is about body image and it's about what you look like on the outside and what you're like on the inside. And it has a kind of religious allegory and a political allegory going on underneath, and it's called Mug. And I thought it was a very intriguing film.